Dear Sola Fide family, for us, this Sunday is All Saints Sunday. That means that that we both remember what God has done for those loved ones of ours who are at rest in heaven right now. And and we remember what God is doing for us right now. That that means that this Sunday we celebrate the fact that God's saints are blessed both now and and forever. That means that these days that we're living in right now of, of a whole bunch of uncertainty with elections and with sicknesses and with economy, it means we're neither filled with, with worry nor rage at the things that are out of our control because we know that, that the one who, who has created all things and who has redeemed us by the blood of his Son is sitting on his throne and that he, that he has both the power and the love to be able to bless his saints, those who have been washed clean in the blood of the Lamb, to bless those saints right now as we live and to bless us forever with life with him. As you have the opportunity, you can sign up for worship both in person and, and, uh, and, and to follow the links to be able to worship online this coming weekend. Um, our Bible study will continue to be uh, a look at uh, civil government and the Christian's responsibility to and, and expectations from. We have opportunities to, to join in, in Bible study on Tuesday morning as we look forward to worship the following Sunday and on Thursday evening as the ladies um, continue the women's Bible study. As we take advantage of the opportunities for our families with, with Sunday school materials and, and, and couples with the, the marriage moments videos throughout the week, rejoice that our God continues to speak to us through his word and, and guides us by that word. Lead it, let it lead us to, to pray for one another. Pray for, for Donna Benitsky as, as her health is, seems to be failing. Um, continue to pray for the Zion Tech family as, as Tom is treated for cancer. Um, pray for, for the Desveen family as Raymond and Dorothy and, and their large, loving, extended family have, have again experienced grievous losses in, in, in recent days. Pray for our country and and for the peace that needs to, to to reign and also for our veterans as as we as we thank god for them and for their service for us and to us let us pray watch dear lord with those who wake or watch or weep this night and give your angels charge over those who sleep tend the sick give rest to the weary pity the afflicted soothe the suffering and bless the dying and all for your love's sake. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. May God bless your, your All Saints weekend.